Um, I'm Olivia Hatch. I am the Vanderbilt Catholic 8th grade student of the year as well as the student of the year for the Homo Thibodeau Diocese. Definitely, like, from a very young age, I was, like, a pretty shy kid. But, like, every year, little by little, like, the teachers were like, "One well, Olivia, you can do it. Like, just, like, pushing me to be, like, more, like, out of my shell. And definitely, I have come out of my shell a lot. But one teacher that was, like, the biggest impact on helping me come out of my shell was Miss Ontario. She was, she did amazing things for me. She not only taught me, like, just, presenting and like academic things, but also just building me up as a good Christian, like offering us different service projects throughout the year just to go do. And she was very, she was a huge impact on my life. Oh, very much. And my family's always raised me to be faithful, like all, since I was little, like we'd always like read our devotionals in the mornings and stuff. And as I've gotten older, my parents have also helped me more, like just become like a good like young woman and in Christ. And that has meant so much to me. Just knowing you have like a savior just to like fall back on. If you ever need anything, just like, hey Jesus, can I have some help? Like he was always there in a big present in my life. and continuing now in Vanderbilt, that's also built me up a lot. I've been part of many clubs here, including campus ministry and pro-life that have done so much for my faith as well. At St. Bernadette, we'd have to do service hours, so I'd always go do mine at the nursing home. And like I, whether it be like playing bingo with the residents and helping them, or like helping to serve the food, it was just always amazing. And I've made some awesome connections and been able to have some like amazing talks with some of the elderly. Just seeing like the smile you can put on their faces, like just by being there, like just your presence, even those who like don't get their family to visit them a lot, like it's so rewarding experience. My like, one of my biggest inspirations in faith is St. Teresa of Calcutta. And she, like, her biggest statement is that we should, it's no great acts, it's small acts with great love. And I really try to live by that. That, like, even though, like, since I'm, like, smaller and I can't really, like, go out and make, like, a huge difference, that, like, even my small acts, like, even if I could just make one person throughout the day, like, smile or just happy, like, that is very rewarding to me. And I really, take those experiences that I'm able to put a smile on somebody's face, I take them very much. I am very, I owe a lot to many of the people who have helped me out in my life. My parents, they work, both work in the medical field and so they are both helping professions and I hope to go into that one day. So they have given me such inspiration just to work for everything you can get and like Things will be given to you, but you also need to work very hard. So that has helped me so much. And teachers in the past have also just helped me with my personality. And um, coaches have helped me become humble and just a great overall athlete and person. So I owe it all to them. And like more importantly, I owe it all to God for giving me my abilities that I am able to do my sports and my academics and just balance it all. And 